Welcome to my Warglobe devlog. Devlog. Hmm. Welcome to my Warglobe devlog. Right now, I am considering how to show stuff on the HUD once again. I used there used to be a list of uh, of actions going on, and I'm not sure why it's it's not appearing anymore. So I have to look into that, and I'll probably use this text which says action and state at the bottom to describe how many targets I'm hitting and so on. Let's go do that. So it looks like after taking a look at this after lunch, it seems that maybe the uh, targets are getting registered, but because I do have clones of, of uh, for target markers, but they are not tracking, so they don't seem to be enabled in any way. Okay, so I believe I've found the issue. The thing was that my in line of sight uh, script was not acting correctly and it was always returning false. So now if I always return true, then I'm able to see who's in my line of sight. And here I see that I have a friendly and his, his name is Tarkov and he's at 327 meters. So if I back up, those numbers will increase. So there's a default UI element for the HUD that, that has a bold text and a number and a shape underneath. And I'll change the shape and the color of it depending on what type of target we have. There are other th improvements that need to be made to the HUD right now. Um, hmm. One of those would be the uh, angle of attack and MAC marker. They don't really make any sense. Also, the altitude is always zero. So I definitely need to improve the, those and find a more consistent HUD design, let's just say. One next thing I might want to consider is adjusting those problems with the altitude indicator and so on. I find the, um, the speed indicator to be kind of in the way, so I will look for a better way to design that. 